Hello viewer and welcome back to Games with Dialogue plays Dragon Quest XI. We're on episode 29 now. We've gone through the dark mural um, and stopped right before the boss, as is tradition. Uh, my computer was messing up a little last time and I had to cut some of the dungeon, but it's not really a big deal. I didn't fight anything, I didn't discover any special abilities, I didn't open any treasure chests, except for one, which I'll show you. Anyways, I apologize for that, but that treasure chest down there, that was a mini metal. Uh, the only way to get over there was to come around from down, If you, I don't know if you guys can see it from here. There is a platform behind this big circular one where my head's at, um, which I completely skipped the first time. Um, anyways, we got it. That's what's important. On to the boss, and... Alright, fine. On to the boss, and the resolution, and hopefully the magic key. I would love for this episode to be hunt down magic key spots and all the treasure chests that go with it. Anyways, let's deal with Dora the Explorer, shall we? <laughs> it's over. We've got you cornered. Cornered? <laughs> it is you who have painted yourselves into a corner. Poor drab fools! <laughs> That's clever, Dorian Gray. If you guys don't know what that is, it's a... I don't know if it's a short story. It's a story. It's a written work of fiction. Why Look it up. The woman who lured Google it. It's pretty good. Into a trap so she could turn them into paintings? Not likely. But why? Why did you do all of this? <laughs> why? For beauty, of course! For my masterpiece! Each of you will be a splash of color on my magnificent canvas! You should welcome such a fate! Ah, oh, how I wish that greatest of beings had given me this gift sooner! Crossing dimensions, collecting colors with which to adorn my work! Such fun! And the world is so much better for it. You allow your basest urges to bring you to me, and I transform you into something altogether less ugly. I don't cry when I say the mural brings fortune. It brings the good fortune of becoming a part of my masterpiece! <laughs> Everyone. Uh, maybe I should switch out Salvando and Eric for this fight. Um, let's do the guard. Uh, Eric. Uh, I'm gonna have you boulder bringer her. Look out below! Just for some extra DPS. Uh, Veronica. That might work, but she has a boss. Hmm. What about Magic Berry? Yeah, for all the group. Uh, he's still pepped up. But it hits a group of enemies, though. I'm gonna swap him out. 
Jade's... Okay, good. Jade's no longer cursed. I'll sweep him out for her. Oh, yeah. I gotta do that. Okay. Is it my turn? And she's pepped up too. Awesome. Oh, that's not gonna... Ah, that's not gonna help. Well, thankfully, it doesn't really matter if you do that. Jade's all about the bashing. Eric. Uh, let's envenom her if possible. Nope. Nobody needs to heal. So, let's hit her. Okay, now we need to heal. Um, you know what I'm going to do? Wait, line up. I'm going to swap out Veronica for Rab, because he can do both damage and healing. And I already have three physical attackers who are doing fine, so. Mm, hip drop, cattle prod, harvest moon. Yeah, we'll just hit her. Yeah. Two crits in a row! Jade. You're amazing. All right, let's try that and venomate again. Kill a miss. That boulder bringer's doing good work, though. Thank you, Eric. That's fine. He wasn't using his ability. His abilities weren't working, anyways. Rab, I need you to heal. Uh, let's do more heal on Jade before she drops. There we go. I'll hit him. I could have healed. I don't know why I didn't heal. Hit her again. There we go. And hit her again. Oh, I see. His offhand is missing. That's why. I thought it was the envenomate, but she's envenomed. No, what? Capture Jade's heart and... Oh, man. Thankfully, I think I have something that can... Let's see. Confusion. I want Charmed. Nope, not on him. But we'll heal. Me. Rab should have something then, right? No. What about spells? Here's an ally of Bedazzlement and Blindness. I don't think that's it. Effects of Confusion. I don't think that's it. Actually, is Charm... No, Confusion's the one with the stars above their heads. So that is not it. Shoot. Um. Afflicts spells. And we'll do. Surely I've got something that can get rid of. Lifts a curse from a single. I knew I saw something in my group makeup that would remove a curse. Alright, well, let's do yes, Rider's so, Reign. So. Jade is just gonna. We're gonna have to take whatever Jade throws at us. Unless Eric's got something that removes charm. Uh. Nope. I thought I did. I guess I don't. That sucks. Can I hit her? Not with Eric. He'll hit her twice. I don't want that. And I don't have anything there. Alright. She's gonna hit us. That's how it's gonna happen gonna have to deal with it. Uh, eh. Wasn't so bad. That is bad, though. Hmm. Do I want to heal Jade again or attack? I want to attack is what I want to do. Zam? Uh, let's see if it works on a dark creature like her. Yeah, it's fine. Not great. I should have used my turn to heal instead, but whatever. We'll hit her again. I think Bubble Bringer, Boulder Bringer faded though, so I should have cast that instead. His abilities are still locked, so maybe that wouldn't have worked. Oh. 
And we are gonna heal again. Let's do mid on me. Ah, oh, come on, Jade. Snap out of it. Let's do Boulder Bringer. Uh, we need to heal Eric. I pepped. I pepped, I pepped. That means I... Oh. Whose turn is it? If I pepped, how come I can't... Alright, whatever. Yes! Boulderbringer does the work! And stay down. Fantastic! Six... Oh, man, that's beautiful. Look at how much gold I got. Ah. Zing. All right, good. Nice. Zing's the one that brings people, can bring, bring people back to life. Dog yet. Rab gets drain magic. Okay. I haven't had to use that yet, but that's good. Thank you, Veronica. Serena learns a new spell. More heal. Good, good. My cleric gets more cleric-y. Uh, do you use one of your skill points right away? No, let's wait until after the cutscene with the boss. How, how did you... An ugly victory! But listen well, foolish humans. Your battle cannot be won! You will never defeat my master, my muse, my inspiration, my Mordagon! <gasps> Still a stupid Mordagon. name. Very stupid name. <laughs> when his vision is at last realized, when his world comes into being, I shall return. Wait! You have to tell us more about Mordigan. <laughs> you will learn more soon enough. Master, may these unsightly souls be cursed, and may you live forevermore! <laughs> Mordigan. Finally, we're getting close. Wait. We know that he corrupted an ancient kingdom by possessing one of its most powerful people. Could now what be the ruins of that kingdom? Yes. She said something about wanting him to live forever. Is that what Mordigan wants? Is that what all this has been about? There we go. The magic key, eh? To the victor go well, the spoils. Nothing else will be able to open a door or two we couldn't before. Who knows what we'll find? Now he can open any door marked with its symbol. All those well, red doors. A nice wee bonus for our troubles, eh? Now, I don't know about you, but I'm about ready to leave this accursed place. Yep. Uh, now would be a good time to spend those skill points, I think. Let's see. Uh, dialogue, I want this one. Or this one. Uh, that would have been useful. <laughs> that would have been useful last episode. Uh, last fight, I mean. But I want to go up into these abilities also. Um, yeah, yeah, I want to go up into the Swordmaster abilities. Eric learned a new pet power that can be performed. Edge of Sleep. Serena learned a new pet power that can be performed. Light of the Living Dead. Fantastic. And that's going to take me 12. Do I have anything over here that's 4th 4? No. Alright. Who's next? Eric. 
And uh, let's do... Do Guile, since it's 10. Dodge chance. Deafness. Deafness, definitely. Deafness increases my ability to steal, among other things. Dodgy character, and then maybe if I get this one, I can get this one. Alright. Next is Veronica. Seven, I don't think she has enough for anything here. Thirteen, thirteen, thirteen. Maybe whips, but I'm not going to waste my time with that. Ten and ten, all right. Serena, same difference. Rab. Rab should have something he can buy, right? That's ten. That's eight. And that's five. Um... He hardly ever attacks with heavy wands, but it does help offset... Yeah, we'll pick it up. It does help offset the MP he uses, and it does let me break this open. Summon a sigil that increases all party members' chance of infecting crit... Okay, same thing that um, Veronica has. Alright, good. Let's leave this horrible place, then. Did we manage to freeze Baza and his group of cronies? Or are they forever gone? Lost within the void. <sighs> yep, we freed everybody who was fantastic. Well, well. I guess we saved the day again. Come on, Eric, be happier about it. We saved the day again, you and me. What is happening, please? So many people are coming out of the ruins. <gasps> what in the name of heaven? Oh, please. Please let li this be like at the end of Ghostbusters 2, and it's our group posing. Ah, that was... that would have been perfect. You have done something to our mural. Where is it? Tell me. Uh, she was evil and we killed her. Destroyed is more... Destroyed her. We're free! We're back in the real world! Thank crikey for that! <laughs> and don't come back, you stupid painting! <laughs> the real world? What is he talking about, please? No, you are lying! The mural did all these terrible things? If this is true, then we owe you a great debt, friends. Come, you must stay at our inn again this evening. Free of charge, of course. Oh god, they... I didn't have to walk up and down the mountain again. See, this is... Ah, <sighs> that bothers me. Forcing me to walk up and down the mountain three times just to skip ahead this time. At the end. I don't, I don't understand that, that design, the, the thinking behind that. It's really annoying though, I'll tell you. I'm never coming back here. Oh, you're leaving already? I must thank you before you go. You have saved our town and given me many great new business ideas into the bargain. Goodbye to the home of the fortune-bringing mural, and hello to the town of the mural that swallows humans whole. <laughs> Tourists love scary stories. Now I must go. I have a fresh batch of replica murals to sell. <laughs> <laughs> they certainly know how to spin a set back into a sale round these parts, eh? We'd better be putting our best foot forward too. Why don't we get out there and see what that magic key unlocks? I couldn't agree more, I'm Grandpa. Sure I remember seeing a door with the same symbol as the key on it over in Svardsrust. It was near that Warrior's Rest Inn. Let's not get too bogged down in the old treasure hunting, though, eh, laddie? There's Mordigan we really need to be worried about. I'm more certain than ever that he's the one behind the change in King Carnelian. Daddy, oh. <laughs> Rab's right. We need to get moving. I don't know how Mordigan's planning on achieving eternal life, but I know one thing. We're going to stop him. 
Hmm. What are you for defeating the boss? Okay. Uh, there was one up here. Yep, I see it. Red door. Right up this way. Alright, so this episode will be treasure hunting, then. Um, I have to go up and around that way. Shoot. And then down. And then right here. We'll leave... We'll leave the one in the ruins until the end, because there's so many more to do. Hi! I bet he's keeping track of us through these things. Secrets of the Silversmiths. Silver tiaras. I bought one, but if I can make one more. Curasses. Eric can use that. Silver mail. Well, I've already got something better than silver mail. Sage's elixir. What is that? 90 MP. Yeah, she can hold on to it. Sure. All right. Um, I could buy stuff, but I don't want to here. Actually, yeah, this is probably the last town we'll be at before we go to the ruins. So whatever we buy here is... You know what? No, 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 no. If I spent money here, all the cool items I find throughout the magic doors will be worthless. Or the money I spent will be worthless. Except that I think every single region had one. Yeah, see, there's one over there by the cryptic crypt. So we have to run all the way over there. Okay. Here's our second door. What did we get? Vanishing blade. Uh, somebody can use this. What about me? Is it a two-hander? I uh, can't tell. But it's better than what I'm using. Yeah, it's two-hander. Awesome! Look at that! Well, maybe not a good... There we go. Fantastic. Alright. Next one on the list. Hmm. Next one on the list. Where are we gonna go? Uh, Hodo Steps. Galopolis City. I don't... Yeah, there was one in the city. It was over here on the right. Well, let the game catch up because of the lag. And that should be fine. All right. Ooh. Thank you. There's nothing. There we go. Pretty Betsy. Oh, another one of you, huh? Another mini metal. Fantastic. That brings us up to six, I think. Two thousand, okay. Not bad. Recipe book, making the magic happen. Hocus Loki. Hocus hats. Fizzle retardant suits. Oh god, finally a new upgraded suit for Veronica. Seed of skill. I appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, where to next? Um, is there a door outside of Galapagos? I can't remember. No, there's not. Um, so, Gondolia has one. I know that. I remember that. Let's see. There we are. Uh, let's see. It is over there at the end of the dock. Okay. Another mini metal. I figured most of the mini metals would be inside these. A good portion of the mini metals would be inside these rooms. Seed of magic. Diamond. Okay. 
Anything to read on the shelves? No. All right. Recipe book, Divine Designs. Seraphic Scepters. A pair of angel sandals. Okay. Uh, so where to now? Outside of Gondolia, there wasn't a door. Um, let's see. What does the map say? Where have I been after that? Zwara Dust, we go there. Octagonia, there was one in Octagonia, I think. I can't really remember, but... I know there was one in Dun Dundrasil. Alright, next one on our list. There's actually two here. If I recall, where's the... There it is. So there's a big door over here that... I want that. There's a big door over here. Uh, if I can find it. Oh, never mind. This is the one I'm thinking of. I thought... I don't know what I was thinking, but that wasn't it. So there's only one here. Fine. Three mini medals? Fantastic. Uh, okay. So what's next after that? Zara Dust. Let's see. Puerto Valor. I'm sure there was one there. So let's go there. All right. Let's see if there's one here. Yeah. There is, right down the middle. Okay. I'm trying to rack my brain where else... Every island has one. Well, almost every island has one, so... I guess now is a good time to visit every island. Or visit the islands. I was, um, planning on doing it again anyways. Now that I can, I might as well. Falcon Knife Earring. Is that a... What is that? A dagger designed to look like an earring. Alright, so that goes to... Eric. And we'll replace the Assassin's Dagger. Oh yeah, definitely. What does it give me? We'll make two attacks at once? That's fantastic! I wonder if that works in his offhand. Hmm, I wonder if that works and we'll have to test it, I guess. Okay. Alright. We should now... Is that a quest over there? Have I not done that quest? Hold on. Oh, right, right. Shiver me timbers, right. Uh, alright. Well, now's a good enough time as any to go to all these extra... Islands that are scattered around. Um, let us go to. Hmm. I guess we'll go to the strand and head to, to the islands. And. I think this one down here is actually the bandit key, not the magic key. But this one up here, that I skipped over last time, does have one of each. Alright, well that fight, good news, Eric's falcon earring knife, dagger, whatever, does attack twice in the offhand. I get three attacks. <clears throat> Okay, let's skip this fighting nonsense and open up this key door. Thank you. Falcon Blade. That's probably better for Silvando. Eric could probably use it as a sword, and I can probably use it as a sword, but... For Silvando, since he's using an actual blade. Oh, what? 
We'll make two attacks at once. So even though the attack damage goes down, I'm definitely taking it. Plus, I can use some pearls to make it better. It won't... Eh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, yeah. Alright, let's get back on the boat, because I can't teleport to each island, so we gotta do this the long, hard way. And we'll be back here later for that locked door over there. And the crossbow target that I still haven't found on this island. Alright, um, there was another island way up here. And I feel like I'm still forgetting... Fantastic. Alright. Um, we're coming up here. I might... It might have been in the Phenomenon region, actually. Um, Alright, that island didn't have any locked doors. Um, actually, I'm going to come back to that island later, so we're just going to skip over what I did on it. I need to get over there. The fastest way to do that is to probably teleport to Lana Lulu and then sail around the outside of the yeah sail around the outside of the um mainland that way Oh, I didn't check Lana Lulu. There is a Oh, I didn't check Lana Lulu. There is a I knew I forgot one. Okay. So let's go get it then. Awesome. Okay. Oh, I'm so glad I teleported back here while going across the islands. A bunch of rats. One treasure chest. Suit of zombie mail. What is? Ominous... Ominous armor that somewhat surprisingly provides protection against curse and dark. And only I can wear it. Okay. Well, um... Is it better than the Drazilian armor? Because... It's going to take a lot for me to get... Nope. Although I can buff it with some pearls. It's going to take a lot for me to get rid of this armor now. Another mini metal. Thank goodness. Okay. Uh, and so, our time in Lana Lulu comes to a close. Let us... Oh, well, there's still one more quest we have to do. But, um, let's get back to the island adventure. Okay. Uh, so we have... Once the world map catches up. We have one island on our right. And one island at the very north that I haven't been to yet. And then we can use the um, harp to get to that lake in the center. Okay. Alright. I haven't been to either of those two last two places. It's Lulu. Um, is there any other spot? I don't think there's any other spots to stop along this coastline. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any other docks. Which is kind of boring, if you ask me, but at the same time, it's not like there's... What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Having random areas that I can explore, it just... It... It's fine for RPGs, but it... I mean, we've already got the islands. We don't really need additional side wandering that doesn't get us anything. Okay, is there... There is a key we need, but it's the wrong key. Ah. All right. Well, there's a shiny over there.
That's the figure for the quest, right. The guy in Lana Lulu. Awesome, okay. So, even though this island doesn't have a red door, I won't skip over it then. I won't edit it out. All right, but we're not gonna go head back to Lana Lulu just yet. There's still one island I want to catch. Uh, what is this way out here? It's just nothing, right? It's just a piece of land. I wonder how far out I can go. Does the map loop around? I bet the map loops back around. All right. Well, we're going to hit the island, and then we'll hit this glowing patch of light water. Actually, okay. The other one I'm seeing is on the other side of the map. So we'll skip this for now. Alright, let's heal, because that was a particularly nasty fight. Oops, I didn't mean to do that twice, but whatever. Serena's got the MP to spare. Alright, I'm looking for docks along the back side here, but... I don't think I'm going to find one, mostly because the map says there isn't one, so... The map hasn't lied to me yet. It's not like there's any secret hidden stuff. Alright, we're going to check this island. I haven't been here before. Let's see. I don't see a key, but... Still, we haven't been here before, so maybe there is... Maybe we can find that crossbow bolt. I. Maybe I can find that crossbow bolt. Uh, tar not bolt, target. Crossbow target. I don't know what... Anyways. There has to be some... There has to be some good stuff on this island anyways, right? Some shinies to pick up, perhaps? I hate with all this foliage. It makes it so hard to see if there is an actual factual crossbow target. How big is this island? All right, all right. I haven't actually explored the whole thing yet. Well, there's a shiny. And full of glass frit. Oh, hello. Away with you, world walker. I'm fishing for a tribute fit for a queen. Oh, he's trying to find something for the queen of mermaids, maybe? Oh, I almost missed that. Can I get over there? Yes, I can. Please be some platinum. Please be some silver now that I've got that silver recipe book. I think I'm really low on silver. Actually, I think I've used it all up. Okay, I didn't see a crossbow target, but we still have... Well, we don't really have much more to explore. Is that a metal slime or just a mana war? I think those are just mana wars. Not not worth it. No shinies over here. Where was that other shiny I saw? Is it over here? Right there. I see it. I see it. Okay. Well, I didn't really need that, and I didn't find... That really bothers me. That really bothers me. Where could the target be on this island? If there's one for every island, then there, one, there should be one over here. I don't see it. I don't see it out in the water. I don't see it up in the trees. I don't see it amongst the rocks. Wait, was that a shiny? No. All right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to check the island map real quick. I missed one. Right there. Okay. I figured I did. I don't... I just... I don't see any targets. I'm going to have to look it up, and that bothers me. It bothers me less than hunting for something continuously over and over and over and getting frustrated. 
that I can't find it, however. Okay, I don't see it. Yeah. If it's here, I don't see it. And if it's over here... I don't see it. Maybe behind this rock? No. <sighs> okay. Yeah, it's not over there. Yeah, alright. Back on the ship and let's go down that teleportation light beam thingy -a mob in the water. We'll have to do those crossbow things later. I'll make a, um, I'll definitely record it, but I'll just piece them together as a montage. Alright, let's come over here then. Go down this. Alright, that was nothing. Yep. Okay. One tiny island in the middle, the landlocked sea. Sure. Awarded for making port at each of the many islands scattered... Okay. Thank you. And that has a magic door. Fantastic. There's also a little treasure chest over here. And a mini metal. Nice. I wonder how tough this guy is. Hey, let's check you out. Mastodon. Ah, that's cute. Very cute. Uh, let's see if Mastodon here has anything good. What's yours is mine! Really, Eric? Even with that buff and deafness? Ah, whatever. Let's do cutting edge. I want to see this in action. Okay, not too bad. I thought it'd do more damage. Uh, Zam will be fine. And let's try that again, shall we? Green eye. Oh, okay. I don't think I need it for anything in crafting, but... I will need it for something well, in crafting. That was easy. All right. So most of the island, uh, these rock guys, the golem-looking dudes, I've fought before, but these whirly boldy holders. Nah, I'll just skip them unless they happen to catch me. Wait. Come on. That's the first time I've picked up one of those. I do not see a target over here. Yes, I do not. Hmm. I don't see one over here. And I don't see one back... Can I get up here? I cannot. I do not see one back here. Nope, never mind. Found it. I'll... Island Centralis. Fantastic. That's two. And what do we got here? Vial of Sainted Soma. I'm, I'm going to have to see what that is. That... What? An incredible liquid infused with angelic essence. Uh, it's got to be for crafting. All right. Well, that's cool. Anything else? Any other shinies? Anything else I've missed on this island? Because I'm never coming back here again. Nope. I got everything on this island I needed. Well done. 
Did I come over here? Does it matter? All right, let me check one. Nope. Nope. Everything's here. All right, let's teleport out of here. Was there a locked door underwater? I can't remember, but let's end the episode checking that spot. All right, there wasn't anything in the water. Um, so that wraps up our episode for today. I think uh, I'm going to do some crafting and um, hunt around here in the northern part of Phenomenon. And then we'll pick it up from there next episode. Thank you, everyone, for joining me. Until then, stay safe and God bless you.